Hello and welcome again to How Not To Draft MTG. Ooh, what's this on the side of the screen? It's Steam, so we can chat with Matt, because he is in the same draft as well. On a different right. computer. On a different computer. On a different on house. our other account. So, you'll be able to see his uh, his view of this, and then our view of this, and then it'll, it'll be a lot. And the worry is around the table. Mm. So, let's talk about the pack. Wow. One of the one of the prolifer removals I think we'll yeah, probably take. Easy. Spine Doctor will be pretty cool. Oh, Matt says hi. <laughs> <laughs> Tell just, him we got card. <laughs> just just for you guys, Matt's also gonna be recording, so for this video you guys get to see a double draft. You get to see both two draft videos, which I know is the favourite of most people. Which is good. <laughs> I think Vulture is oh. probably better than Grim Affliction. I say yes because the black is there's these two good black cards. Yeah, and it, it just kills something with one extra power as well. Mm-hmm. Volt charge. Volt charge. We're charging those volts, and they're going well. Oh, that's a progression. Just to call a judge over for that one. Yeah. Two of the same card. What's going on there? Well, no. In professional drafting, they take out all foils and replace them with another card. Hmm. Yeah. Ooh. Interesting. Uh, what are we thinking? I'm thinking one of these personally. If we're really? gonna stick in red. Yeah, they're 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 pretty good. I think we take the foil one. Yeah. The the the, the best thing to do with them is they attack. You take probably the guy that would offer the best trade instantly. And block yeah, and block it. Yeah, it does work well. Uh, yeah, I'm happy with that. That's fine. Oh, we're doing one more one, by the way. Yes, I don't know if we mentioned that. Hmm, pure steel paladin. Yeah, not no, great. Is not he? impressed with it in draft. I think blinding soul is. Yeah, like I was about to mention that. Or Gears shrine of loyal legions. What am I about? Uh, shrine of loyal legions. I think is more of a bomb. Should we go with that then? Should we go yeah. for that white red deck? We usually have Blandy Soul here, let's have the, the Legion this time. And in all fairness, Loyal Legions goes everywhere, so. And it's good with Vulture. It is. One, oh, oh. one extra dude. We're on third pick and we're already building synergies. <laughs> That's how we work on another level. We're that awesome. Indeed. If you uh, think Shrine of Loyal Legions is a blowout by itself, go watch our previous video, then you'll see a much of a bomb it can be. <laughs> Exclusion uh, Ritual's good, yes, white. I think so as well. Um, Ogre Menial's pretty good. Yeah. Um, In fact, this is some pretty good cards. That's good, that's good, that's good. Yeah. That's good. That's pretty damn good. Yep, she that's good. good. Yeah. I'm still happy with the Exclusion Ritual though. Yeah, it's, it's amazing. Yeah. If you guys have been watching the Nagoya stuff, there was that guy who was talking about how somebody destroyed his Exclusion yeah, Ritual. Beast, beast within his Exclusion Ritual, hoping to get his Consecrated Sphinx that he uh, imprinted back out of it. He was like, no, that doesn't <laughs> <laughs> it was quite amusing. So we're, we've got quite a nice little control deck going on here. And to touch on what Joe said, make sure you do watch the uh, the Pro, Pro Tour Nagoya <laughs> coverage on Wizards MTG YouTube channel or on Daily MTG. Yeah. Because it's awesome. Uh, do <sighs> we're, we're going out of colour then, probably one of the green cards. Yeah, there's some nice green here, isn't there? Um, the only card it's that's... Not Stain on colour is the shrine of limitless power. I mean, we can, we could play that, but I don't think we will. No, no, no. But either of the green cards. Yeah, the green cards are probably the strongest too. I'm I probably a, the creature to be honest, because we don't have any. Really, not the combat trick. Uh, I don't know. I don't, I don't like these two cards, so we're not going to pick them. Yeah, go on then. Let's go with the cobra. Yeah. He's just a solid dude, isn't he? I'm pretty sure we'll probably just stay in red and white and just pick up some guys. But there's oh. brutalizer exarch. Okay, so see, we've been told to take this. Yeah, we were. I still think it's a little bit expensive for yeah. this one. This one. What? So it's it does give you a lot more mana. That's the thing. And what comes out with look? It's just mirrors, isn't it? So yes, yeah, so we have interaction. How's shards for us? Not great. No, we kill our shrine of loyal legends. <laughs> uh, so I think the exile is probably. I think it's probably the best card. I think even. we could splash that as well, even if we need. Oh yeah. Go on then, let's pick up the XR. Uh, what does this say to us? This says Slag Fiend isn't good, but everyone knows that already. <laughs> yeah, but I, is it okay to take now? Or just as a. Uh, just as maybe like a 3 3 dude, maybe at some point? Is it equal to number of artifacts? In all graveyards. We don't have I don't think I, know, I don't think artifacts are very prevalent, prevalent anymore. Yeah. Yeah. Um, but to be honest, should we just. Or do we take the four six guy as he's reasonably okay? That's not even feasible. We <laughs> only had six picks. I think the 
take the white dude because it's an uncolored creature. This guy? Yeah. <laughs> Wait, I got 11. This is a stacked set. What's the superior? Um, we don't really have a white plan. Though. Green trick or red swine? Actually, it's red yeah, swine. That's yeah, pretty yeah, late for the swine. That's fine. That's fine. I think red is probably our. Mm, I don't even know what our strongest color is anymore, to be honest. Oh, probably red. Yeah, okay, no, 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 that's not bad. He breaks the mold. Protection is nice. We're getting past quite a lot of green. Um, I think maybe this though, because that worked really well for us in our yeah, previous yeah, draft. Just, just destroying something is good. So we're not sure about white or green. Mm -hmm. We're one of them, I think. I we think. Would prefer white. Yeah, this card is probably on par. Well. These oh. cards are equally strength, I think, but then I think probably the Cobra is better than the Survivors. Yeah. So probably the green slightly edges it for us at the moment. Fair enough. But the Exclusion Ritual is good. Yeah, it's the Shrine of Allegiance would benefit from white. Yeah. Because playing white with look, with the Shrine allows you to cast Shrine of Law Allegiance on a later turn and still be effective. A blowout, yeah. If you're playing it not in white, then it's only incrementing at one. I'm playing it with white, you're probably going to increase it. Uh, let's say 1.6 per turn. Sage Priest. That puts a little bit more towards the white. That's not a bad card. Yeah, I think he's solid. At the end of the day, the worst thing he'll do is chump block and lose them a life, gain you a life, probably. <laughs> more of a uh, more of a vertical line. Um, either, either of the red cards, John. Stop chatting, you. <laughs> Probably the song. Yeah, it's stronger. It's a good. Uh, it's a good trading, dude. Is that how I can song? It can be annoying. Search no, that'll work. So let's look at our curve then. Should we go across sort it out? It's a good forest as well to pick up. I don't think we'll do no, search. No now. way. Oh, he doesn't like it. No, it's terrible. Which is it? Well, it's the Shrine of Law Legions charge cannons. Yeah, of course. And but what is the surge node? Is it when one enters the battlefield, or can you just move? No, the surge node is pay tap. one tap. Per... Oh. Ooh, but well, it's burn the impure. Ah. Better. It's burn the impure. It's better. We, I think we need to not do this and think yes, bomb rare flyer, and just think hey, what's. <laughs> <laughs> no, actually no, I think burn the impure for three damage is not as a good. If it was a go for the throat or maybe even grasp. I know obviously not from this pack for grasp, mm. but What would we wield? We may wield Not much really, is it? Time strike. Probably this will definitely wield yeah, this will wield. I so I don't really want to play well, that. Maybe maybe ogre resistor at a push? Yeah. Would be yeah. an okay wheel. I think take the igniter. Ichaclaw meal will go. The thing about the igniter is it will go. Oculus will go. Ichaclaw wellspring will go. The rager should go. I think. Yeah. Maybe spy serpent will go. I think lead stampede will be left. The armor. Rhino. Rhino. Time strike. Yeah, time strike. So we could maybe get the resistor. Of course, for us, yeah. Yeah, dragon. Woo! We've got a high end. Mirror works. Pooh bears. Mirror works. Into the core is red, strong red. Yeah. Or there's a Mir Sire, because we do have this help out Igniter, so if you pick up some artifacts, because that's where he gets his strength from. I had I started the second pick Mir Sire. Okay. Strandwalker's not bad. Mm, Strandwalker could be a good call. There's no white in this pack at all. No. Apart from Time Strike, it's not really a white card, is it? But what do you think? Yeah, I don't think there's enough for Into the Core, to be honest, to pick it this early. I'd probably take one of a few picks down the line. Okay, we'll go with Strandwalker. Ooh, Relic Ward is nice. Yes. Uh, just check the other pack. No, no, I think Relic Water wins. Seems fine. Right it's only artifact, right? No, or jump. Oh, wow. Ah, yeah. oh, that's why they're it's playing four yeah, of them. That's why it's Tempest still there. <laughs> <laughs> I thought it was just uh, artifact, because he's like a Relic Water. Yeah. Thinking. No, because you think there aren't that many enchantment removals. There's that, Revoke, mm. and the Slice and Twin, I think. What are we doing here? Do we take resistor here? Or There's no green in that pack apart from Tangle Hole. Yeah, no, I'm 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 preferring white now. I think I like the resistor. Yeah. I mean, it's the best card there for us. Where's the ringleader any good? Yeah, I, yeah, I don't dislike him either. I must but admit, I we prefer used to four mana to five mana. 
I must admit we used to see these guys like last pick. Oh now yeah, I, I, yeah, I think, I think we can get another one if we want one of those. Let's go resistor. Yeah, I prefer the resistor. And we don't have a four drop yet, so it works nicely. I think we could probably splash this guy. Yeah, to go get the dragon. Yeah. <laughs> Or it does something else as well, isn't it? Non-creature permanent bottom of library. Yeah, so planeswalkers. So that's like. that's that's not a bad piece of semi-removal type. Master's call could be nice yeah. for us because it gets us some metal craft. If anything, instant speed. Jump and it speed. adds a counter onto this. Yeah. Oh, we could have two different types of mirror out. <laughs> right. It's not our pack yet. Is the sideboard it? guy? Yeah, I was thinking. In the corner. Not much else you can do. Forest walk is uh, is useful. Oh, What's up, Tom? Tom? You've got a creepy beard. <laughs> <laughs> Look, we're drafting, and Matt's drafting as well. He and he's there. In the same draft. Yes. Yeah. He, is he telling you what he's picking or not? No, no. He's well, been... He. We said we had ten cards. He's got eleven apparently, and will appraise us. I think he's lying. Nifool. Dubious. You know, just got a red deck with a little bit of white and one green deck. You know what you should get with Shrine of Loyal Legions? Chance of the Forge. Oh, you've, you've given it away. <laughs> Go and watch our previous video, it was funny. Yeah, Shrine of Loyal Legions, 11 Ooh. mere counters, that's pretty bad. Long and and, and then, then he plays Chance of the Forge. There's the Ringmaster, or another Resistor. I still think another Resistor to Yeah, I think because yeah. they're just a side mirror range, dude. I think you take the Mythic for two. And considering <laughs> we're going to be heavy red anyway, the double red is not less of a problem. Uh, should we move this guy to the sideboard? Another resistor? Wow, maybe the flare house. It was no, okay, so next pack is when we might table that other resistor. Yeah, that's what I mean. I don't Fingers crossed, come on. Well, if they're, 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 they'll pass us. Oh, right. yeah. That was pretty much what we said. Maybe the silver skin armor. That card's not too bad. It does make this guy better. Um, I don't, I'm, not, I'm not averse to it. The only other thing is the rhino, but I'm not a big fan oh, of the so. shiny. No, we does take get a shiny. <laughs> Lead the stampede, it's not good. I don't like it. We're not really green anyway. I, I, I don't think it is. The rhino or the armor? I don't think we'll play either. Yeah. So I think take away the rhino, to be honest, though. Come on, we've got to get scrap melter. Hi, I'll just take the red. No, I think either of the red cards there. Really? Do you like it? too bad. It can, well, I think it does a bolt. It could just be a four damage, you die. Okay. Not taking Arden Recruit. No, that's. Let's go mono red! <laughs> Jeez, it's no one likes Spiraling Jewelist. Mm. Magnet Mine. Take some lands. Oh, should we call it? Good. Is there any milling cards in. Oh, Mindcrank. Yeah, you'd have Mindcrank Shriek on there. No, because Mindcrank is when you damage you. Oh, yeah, no, it's. Oh, I see what you mean. For milling. Uh, is there anything we need to get? I think it's still worth the splash on the X Arch. Argent Sphinx, Ooh. damn you. Oh, Ga Cerebral Eruption. Gal Blast, surely is better. Gal Blast. Cerebral Eruption, you have to tap out usually for mm. it, and you hit land, and it's just like a pain. Yeah, or no. do we want the Slice of Twain? Because maybe now our white's not that good. I'd rather still just stick to it and go red. And I suppose we have Leon in Relic Water for. Yeah, Gal Blast is cool. Pretty much more half out, eh? As a shock, a lot of the fine. removal is an artifact. Ooh, can we pull this guy off? Oh, I wish we'd taken that thing in now. What is um, it? The um, silver skin armor. I still think that's what we take anyway. Or well, just as a one damage pinger. Yeah, that's that's not a terrible yeah. thing. The only other thing is the glint or idol. Oh, we in white. Oh, wait. Oh, yeah. Um, I don't know, but I think I think this our white is really short. I think we we'll, we are only going to be playing like four or five white. I would love it if we could play a mono red. Let's play the Elder. Yeah. Go on, let's do it. We'll push it. Dark Steel Axe. Yeah, Death Mantle works well with it, though. But Tumble Magnet. Yeah, or... Or we Rebecca. can re-swing back and go for Mere Smith is good. So, our chance, our choices are Tumble Magnet... Think, I don't think Nim Death Mantle is bad to take at this point. I wouldn't first pick it in a pack. Maybe not so, but... That's, that's not a bad effect. Hmm. Um... Who against you? I think it's between Tumble Magnet and these two. As well. We won't take the Mere Smith. No, I don't really? The Mere Smith well, we have is amazing. Yeah, we have, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I suppose. Um, to be honest, Tumble Magnet and the guy the way to smash him through with Ogre Resistor could be, seems 
I just Tumblewang is just such a solid card. I think we'd regret it if we didn't take it. Yeah, it's good. It's good. It's nice to have one as well. Another one? Yeah, so I think so. Yeah. yeah. Even better in pairs. Um, just a mirror for some mana acceleration. Yeah, still still mirror, not really, really good. No. no. So choices. Maybe just Nora Replica. He's just the semi wall. Yeah, and just, just, just take the the silver mirror of the off chance. Well, if you want to keep the uh, red thing called Arthur Rebirth and you'll burn out tumble magnets. Nah. Uh, I don't like Call of the Rebirth. Oh, he doesn't like it. I don't. Well, if it was the fold and extraction for the, for the killing of the. Uh, yeah, that, 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 I don't think that's too bad a card either. For just a sweep to get through some damage. Mm. I think I prefer that to the flimsy and neural preference. Yes, yeah, that's fine. They should laugh back up. Yeah. Yeah. More than side. We're not going to hit Metal Craft for it. Yeah. I think we just take it really though. Yeah. Is there very much else. So we'll put it the rest. Standards. Yeah, why not? Let's get some, get some rares in there. <laughs> Rare draft for the win. <laughs> what was our first pick? Um, Foul charge. Yes, it was. Yeah. Um, Gams Gam was. Whoa, 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 origin spell. Yeah, okay, now nah, that origin spell was better. Uh, actually, yeah. it's a bit empty there. Yeah. I think Gams Warden will just be a pillar field ox. That's fine. Uh, take that for the infect match. Yeah, I think I think we need the creatures anyway. To be honest, looking at sensor. Yeah, our favourite. I haven't played with him in a while. Not, not for a while. Hide you from now, but we'll probably bring you back in. I, I, I think the Loxton Wayfarer is better in our deck than the Razor Swine. Really? Uh, I like the Razor Swine. Sounds a bit better. Mm -hmm. Go on. Just in case we need to do it. We've got Flyer Husk. Yeah, Flyer And Strandwalker. Spot Shadow is going to kick ass. <laughs> if, we put, if, we get that, if we get that with uh, Strandwalker, that's going to be some good damage. Oh, of course we've got Strandwalker. I completely forgot about that. Because that's annoying. Is it worth splashing the green for that one card? Cheers, Thanks. Um, let's see in the, in yeah. the deck, bro. Let's see what's going on. Oh, Matt's done. Oh, everyone's done. Sacrifax. Oh, oh, am I? Oh, man. You, you trickster. <laughs> okay. So we're basically mono red. Let's go red first. So we're gonna play that. We're gonna play you. We're gonna play you. We're gonna play you two. We're gonna play probably that main guy. Yeah, I think so. Progression and igniter. Yeah. I think we play razor swine. And I think and we play for Yeah. Uh, flare husk, yes. Yep. Yeah. yeah, I think him. I think solid. Yeah. Low legion, silver mirror. Two tumble magnets is cool. The strand walker is cool. Let's try and deliver this power. No, that's oh no, that's the shit one. Yeah, the Shrine of Lord Legions. Sutra Priest, you're in. Yeah. Relic Order. Yep. Cause we don't expect to get him on turn two. No. Master's Call. I probably wouldn't play it. Gamma's but... Warden, and the Exclusion Rituals are some removal in there. So that's twenty two, with a mirror. Yeah, leave the green to be honest. Yeah, we think we keep the keep the green out and maybe put like Cost Courier in just because he's a dude and if he matches up against the yeah. Forest guy. Okay. Got very low creatures. Well, remember, Strandwalk is a creature, Flare House oh, okay. is a creature, okay, and, and um, Master's Call makes two creatures. Fair enough. Um, I think we're not that bad. I think we're 14. Yeah, we're, four, we're uh, 15 even. Yeah, just landed. Okay, let's add a land. Suggest. Oh, that's noisy. That's very, very different as well. Two, one. I think go. That seventeen like that. Hmm. Early red, not so much. Early white, not so much. Well, probably red is what we want the most because we want to be playing. You need, yeah, the these is just nice and turn these. four. And it, it well, I, I doubt we'll hopefully. get to turn seven without two reds for the yeah. the igniter. So that's not a problem. So this we're yeah. on six. More mountains is good as well for immolating soul eater. 
etc. And right. the uh, it's part of that colour as well. So if you take the Hellcat trigger. Oh yeah, the Soul Eater needs the red. Should we put the Assault Strobe in for that? Let's give let's, let's have Assault Strobe. Let, let's have, have some fun. Let's have some fun. Oh, if Assault Strobe. What should we take out? Um, Take take a soldier back out, maybe. F- <laughs> <laughs> um, we can see post sideboard what was not. Yeah, yeah. We we would like to have fun with it, but I don't know what we cut. I think apart. I think. Yeah. See, if, my we, first if we if we have this, guys, but this works well. I think it's actually proven to myself that. Well, if the guy's got no artifacts and it has forests, then we can take that out and put it in because then soldier goes well, mm-hmm. being with goth curry as well for extra. Damage. Yeah. Okay. Uh, so we're gonna we're gonna submit this and see if we match up against Matt. I hope, I hope we don't match up against yeah. Matt. I, I, I want a I final showdown that between us two. That would be good. That would be so good. So yeah, we'll see you guys later. So like, guys.